Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. It is match day one of the UEFA Champions League and Celtic are in Rotterdam, as the song goes. Anywhere Celtic will fall in. And, um, aye, um, it is match day one and we're away to Feyenoord and they've been on fine form. Um, I think at the weekend they won like 5-1 or 6 or something like that in the Premier game, Premiership game uh, in their league, uh, uh, the Vizzy. Um, but it was a good point. I was thinking about it as well and we've seen it, I've heard about it as well. You know, their league, you know, like the teams are playing are not, you know, don't understand the Celtic, you know what I mean? But it's pretty much like if Celtic are playing like a Livy or something, you know what I'm talking about, like them kind of teams, but Celtic should be battering. But we, you know, the weekend, first half was quite poor. Second half, we shown, you know, that bit of quality that we saw at Ibrooks. Um, and we won 3 0. Uh, all the goals in the second half, of course, you can see that match day vlog in the, on the channel already. Um, but yes, tonight is the first day match day of the 23 24, the last um Champions League with all the systems, it'll be all changes next season. But tonight, Celtic do play in Rotterdam and Feyenoord. Um, couple of good couple of energies for Feyenoord, the goalkeeper's out. Um, and I heard somebody else is out for Feyenoord, one of the key players, but I don't know if that's true or not. But um, we'll go with that one. Um, but for Celtic, Cameron Carter Vickers is still out, of course. And I did read out the Champions League squad, which Celtic have been put, you know, in from uh, last week. So Cam and Vickers will be a big miss tonight in the in the game. But let's go through team news. Let's go through score predictions and let's see what predict what's going to happen. So I mean, goalkeeper it's got to be Joel Hart. There's no doubt about it. I mean, we've not we've not invested. I mean, the profits we've seen come out from what you know the Champions League money was a forty something million profit. We haven't spent it on a goalkeeper, have we? Goalkeeper or a left back? Because if you look at that Champions League squad. It lacks it. It lacks it. Because if one of them get injured, you're lucky. You're, well, I don't know what you're going to do. Um, but that's another problem for another day. But we should have we should have done it in the summer. But didn't, couldn't get, you know, finger out. And you know what I mean? But, um, aye. Um, Jota with Joe Hart. It's got to be Greg Taylor. He's he performed a lot better on Saturday than he did a few weeks back. And before that as well. Performed a lot better on Saturday. Um, Liam Scales, he's been top man when he has to come in due to the injuries, he's how he's got to come in and do it. Nat Phelps is an injured out. He rolled of his ankle, came off at half time, didn't know why, but the Rangers came after the game, just explained that he rolled of his ankle, he is an injured out. Whether or not he just starts tonight is a pro, a, you know, as a, we'll see. But um, we did see Lagerbell got come on at the second half, he made like one mistake and then he settled down, he looked formed really well in the second half. Obviously, that first, you know, the Kelly loss and then it was the Ibrooks game and you know, it's, things happened and it, you know, it's put mixed opinions. Pretty much like Carl Starfield when he first came to Celtic, he made that mistake, you know, he was a bit shaky and that was his literal Celtic career where he thought, oh, he's going to make a mistake. And that's, I think, how Larga Belt's career is going to go at Celtic. I'm not saying the full story yet, he's saying, oh, he, he could be, but he still, he could be, you know, he's still a fit all potential there, but he's only a couple of games in his career. But Celtic fans just, we don't do that, do we? It's about any player, you know, we don't we don't just settle on, like, um, let's just let him hope he settles in. No, we don't settle that, because we're Celtic fans, that doesn't happen, does it? We're football fans. Um, but I think Larga Belkut will start. Uh, I don't think it will be Nat Phillips, just because the injury concern, we don't want another centre-half injury. I don't how, we, how like, this season couldn't go from, like, how do we get all these injuries? It's incredible. It's in the worst way ever. Um, but Marco Tilo. We'll be back shortly. I'm not talking. You know what I'm talking about the defense, injury wise, but yeah, that should be the defense. And obviously on the right, it's got to be it's got to be Johnson. It's got to be AJ. Um, he formed really well on Saturday. Um, down that right hand side of the park, but it looks like they've came back into a better Taylor and Johnson, if you get me, and it suited Taylor a lot better and Johnson as well, which is really good as well compared to the last few weeks. Which, but you know, except from the Ibr uh, the Dundee and the maybe Ibrox game like that, we've set they've set we've settled in at the inverted, which is good because Taylor prefers that compared to if he's just a normal, you know, like we're, we're just kind of wanted to play, didn't really set him, so that's really good as well. But um, midfield got to set itself. Real tight has got to be in the squad in the team. It's got to be in that. You've got to be practically one of the first. If you look at the team, you've got to be the first one to people in that midfield. The, the team. It's not relevant. It's got to be. I mean, you can't afford to play David Turnbull in the Champions League. I mean, no offence to the guy, but league game, you can maybe get away with it, but not in the Champions League. You cannot. So it's got to be Rio Tati, Cam McGregor, Matt Riley. Um, so it's got to set itself in midfield. It's got to be Rio Tati, Cam McGregor and... Um, Matt Riley, Matt Riley scored on the goal sheet again, phenomenal performance, McGregor looked back to him, kind of self his gain on the weekend as well, lovely assist for Kyogo, um, any attack, you know, but maybe a little less, but you know, 
it's got to be Kyogo. I mean, that game at the weekend, superb by him again, the wee man. Uh, Dizameda, and who started? Big question is who's going to start beside Dizameda? Palmas, you know, who's it going to be? It's got to be Lewis Palma. Um, performed really well when he came on in the second half. Um, wee skills, nutmeg and such like that. But he looked a, he looks a talent, which um, I think if there's a game to play him in tonight, should be starting tonight. Um, I don't think there's, I mean... <laughs> We could, they could be suggesting they also because bad is out. We could be playing some. I, I can't think of that. Me, there's got there's an obvious player in. I can't think of, but it's got to be Lewis Palmer. Um, Lewis Palmer. For, um, is it is it Honduran thing? Is Honduran thing? Um, but he formed really well on Saturday, and I think he deserves his um start tonight and against final tonight. But that is my team. Uh, I am going for one one. I am optimistic um final have been on fantastic form so they've been on you no know, eh, so far this season um but uh, we've been on track after that ibrox result um big result in the afternoon and break obviously three nil against dundee at the weekend final getting that phenomenal um five or six one one at the weekend at home i think it was anyway so we need to be on a game tonight we can't lack this they can't lack these stupid passes these things that we you know apparently we you know we, we can't we can't do these mistakes silly mistakes we could get away with it we saw it in saturday sometimes you can get away with it in the league but you're not going to get away with it in these games in the champions league you're not going to get away with it they're going to finish you they're going to they're going to tear you apart if you if you do that so we should be on a game tonight we can't afford to make any silly mistakes or that we can't afford to get embarrassed in europe that's one thing as well um but i don't think well but um i'm going one one we man Kyogo getting the goal seat. Got to be. But, um, bye, hopeful tonight. But uh, thanks for watching. I'll let you get number back later on for the match reaction of the game. But thanks for all the support on the channel. See you then.